seems like stress and anxiety are on the rise for our families and especially for our kids and for ourselves. So I want to talk about this a little bit today. My name is Dale LaCure and I love to help families create health and harmony using holistic mental wellness solutions. You know, I have a couple of questions that maybe to consider and I know that this is the craziest time (laughs) in the world right now. It is just crazy. And I talk to parents every day about what can I do to help my kids? So just a couple of things to think about. You know, first of all, what are you doing to help yourself? Our kids are so in tune to the way we feel, especially little ones. Like if we are stressed, they feel that energy, even older ones and even teens. Like if we feel like things are out of control or everything's out of control, they get that feeling that things are out of control. So we are the foundation of the family and how we feel is so critically important because that's going to trickle into the rest of the family. To help your child, first and foremost, is to help you to learn how to really stay calm, to feel like you have control over the situation that we can control and let go of the things that we can't. Number one, take care of you. You are the foundation of the family. Number two, Sometimes our kids just need like a sounding board, somebody to really listen and maybe not give solutions, but maybe just listen, let them know that we hear them. Sometimes they just need to like vent like we do too. Sometimes our kids just need to vent and they don't necessarily want our input at that particular moment. But then once they are heard, they know that we are listening, that we are sympathizing, that we are empathizing with them. Then they may be more open to some suggestions. So something that I have always known after raising five kids is the way that our kids feel physiologically is so critically important. If they are not sleeping, if they are not nourishing their bodies, if they are not hydrating, if they are not exercising, they are not going to feel well emotionally. They're going to have more anxiety. They're going to feel overwhelmed and not able to deal with all the stressors that come their way. And the same thing with us. You know, if we're not hydrating, if we are not modeling, you know, good self-care like hydration and exercise and eating well and all of that, we're not modeling that behavior, then they're absolutely not going to be doing that. So again, comes back to you. I know this like It's so critically important. So even with little, little ones, you know, two-year-olds, three-year-olds that are having meltdowns, it's like typically it's because they are not feeling well physiologically. They're very much in tune with their bodies, but not necessarily able to articulate, you know, how they're feeling. So really it's our responsibility as parents to really have them understand and for us also to model good practices, good quality sleep, making sure you're not putting too much on your plate, like having them run and run and run and run to different sports and this and that. And then that gets them into this like fight or flight place, which is not a healthy state for the body to be in. There are many different stories that I have in a group called Mental Wellness Warriors, and you'll see children that had severe anxiety. And one of the things, and my daughter included, had severe anxiety. One of the things that was really helpful was a targeted system called the fundamentals, which is targeting the gut-brain connection. It has changed her life. It is changing lives. It is helping our children and us in a big way, because if your body, if your gut is out of balance, which for everyone pretty much it is because stress impacts it, our diets impact it, toxins impact it, medications impact it. So if your gut is out of whack, you are not creating those neurotransmitters like serotonin, which 90% of that is created in your gut. Dopamine, which is your neurotransmitter for motivation, that is not being transmitted. 70% of that is created in the gut. So you're looking at all the neurotransmitters, GABA, which is which keeps us calm, that is also created and produced in the gut. So we are just seeing just phenomenal, phenomenal stories with kids and adults when it comes to anxiety. So I hope you found this information useful. I am going to spread this word until the day I leave the planet. There are holistic solutions for mental wellness in they are life changing. So I hope you enjoyed this. I will see you again. Know that you can make change. You can do things. There are so many tools available to help us with all the stress that comes our way, especially our kiddos. We got to model it. It's got to come from us first.
All right. Have a fantastic day.